what's up? It's Fat Boy Dan here. Nothing but redneck fishing all year. Fishing videos with all the beer and fun only at FatBoyDanFishing.com. The place for one of a kind type fishing with Fat Boy Dan from Indiana. You won't miss a thing. The greatest catches and product reviews. Catch them all with Fat Boy Dan Fishing videos. Live to fish, fish to live. It's Fat Boy Dan Fishing. FatBoyDamnFishing.com Hey, what's up? Fatboy Dan here, and I'll tell you what I'm doing today. Basically, what I'm out, I'm at my little fishing spot, my little man cave, my little fishing cave. Whatever you want to call it, it's what I call it, is my little fishing cave. Basically, what I'm doing right here, man, I'm doing a casting video for a show called Top Hooker. Now, you, now you're probably thinking, Top Hooker, Fatboy, you gonna become a hooker? No, 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 not no hooker. I'm talking about a top hooker, and y'all know me on YouTube, man. Y'all know about the fishing, the fishing videos, and all that crazy stuff. Well, basically, Top Hooker is a fishing show. We're gonna be taking anglers around the world and putting them together to compete for, you know, the top hooker. Just who can hook the most fish, who can hook something, or hook something. But I know what I've done. I hooked a lot of y'all. And basically, I'm on YouTube now with over 4 million and plus views. Now, that tells you right off the bat. I've hooked a lot of viewers, a lot of subscribers and stuff, and I'm one of the most known fishermen on YouTube. I've even graced the pages of Alan Jackson Country Boy video, Alan Jackson Country Boy music video. That's right, that's me with the, uh, uh, the shirt off. I got my shirt off, my big belly up and stuff. Got the blue shorts on on, on the Alan Jackson video. Uh, barefooted holding up two big catfish. So Alan Jackson thinks that's a Country Boy. Now he put me in that video. Also did a TV show with Ted Nugent called Running Wild with Ted Nugent. Now you're probably thinking about, okay, if we put this fat boy onto a reality show, is he gonna give up because he's fat and overweight? Or, 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 or is he, what's he gonna do? No, I ain't gonna give up, man. I went out on Ted Nugent's show, out in his Waco, Texas ranch. Went out there, did four days surviving out in the wild. Just crazy surviving in the wild. Didn't go out day one, didn't go out day two, day three, day four, we was getting hunted by Ted Nugent. And I survived till the end almost, till the end almost. I was basically running from Ted Nugent, running from him while he had his gun trying to hunt me. It was a paintball gun, but it was a bad gun. It's gasoline, that's, but I was out running that dude. I was surviving in the wild without no food. Yeah, I said no food. So this fat boy right here was like, my belly's growling like a bear. I had to survive in the wild, live out in the uh, thing, build my own shelter. I won that challenge, won the gutting deer, one shoot nine nines, P80s, M80s. Nine nines, 12 gauges. Man, that dude even gave me his shell case. Tell you what, he still owe me money. A hundred grand or so, but hey, that's another thing. But you're probably thinking, fat boy, what, what, you got what it takes. Like I told y'all, man, I'm on YouTube. So check me out on YouTube with over 125 videos with over four million plus views, almost five million views. The most known fishermen. Man, I help some of the best pros out. Now the pros, you, you got them, and they're coming to YouTube now. And then I'm helping some of them get their name out on YouTube because they can connect in the outdoor world on TV when they got them TV commercials pushing them. But when you come to YouTube, this is my world. This is my world. I'm I helping them. So they ain't got what I got on YouTube. So you give me a product review, boom, I'm going to bust it out. Bam. That's why I worked with some of the biggest names in industry. That's right. Fishkill Sunglasses, New Tech, Locker the Lures, Berkeley, Aqua uh, View, underwater cameras. They send me their new stuff all the time. They get it. Monster Rod Holders, Aqua Lung, Renegade Tackle. Man, I've worked with a lot of big companies. Big Fish Tackle, all of them. Their names nice to sound familiar because they are in the industry. They deal with the big pros. They deal with me on the YouTube because I've got what it takes to be a top angler on YouTube. And if i got what it takes to be on YouTube in the real world, not no amateur stuff on TV. I call it amateur stuff because that stuff can be so, I don't even know what to say about them, but you know, let me show you a little bit of some of the stuff I've got, man. As you can see, you're probably thinking, do you got what it takes to be jug fishing, cat fishing, noodling, all that stuff? I've got what it takes. I mean, I've catched the big cats, I catch small cats, bluegills, or whatever it is. I catch it any which way. I catch it anyways. Now, as far as boats, man, I got the boats covered. I've got them covered, whether it's a ski boat, woo! Ski boat, pontoon, jet ski, Man, I do it all, man. I do it all. Let me come, come along while I show you some of my fishing tackle, man. Man, you see my rod stacked over here. I got rods. Man, you want to see something else? Watch this. You want to talk about rods? You want to talk about rods? Boy, I got rods. Glorious. Man, 
I'll tell you. That's how many rods I got, man. I get shit sent to me all the time, and I've got a testing and product review. So basically, me throwing them on the ground don't mean nothing. I'm testing them, making sure they can stand up for the abuse. You know, like my Shakespeare rods, my Abu Garcias, some of the new lines that just hit the market, some of the new Abu Garcia. This is the Kevin Dan Van from Quantum. I mean, these people be sending me their stuff to do on YouTube. Come on, Kevin, come on. Y'all know I got this, man. Y'all know I got this. Let me let me bring it along, man, while I show you exactly what I got in my garage. Show you some of the fishy stuff. Check it out. We got our rods right here. Like I said, tackle boxes galore. Now you're probably thinking, fat boy, is these tackle boxes? Are these tackle boxes like your buddies, your your friends that you brung over just trying to stack up? No, this is the real deal, man. I've got stuff out here, bam. Oh, the nets, look, I got the commercial nets back here if we needed them. I got the old, you know, casting net just, just to have. Another casting net. We got the fish net up here. We got some of the reels, the ocean reel. I mean, I ain't did no saltwater fishing yet, but I'll tell you what, I'd love to take some of my techniques that I do have for adapting to the river and setting trout lines out, jug lines, anything, man. I'd love to put that in some saltwater fishing, like kind of like Bill Dance is doing right now. But look at this stuff. Man, I got old tackle boxes. Man, I got so much shit, man. I don't even know what. I don't even know what I got some of this stuff, man. There's some, there's some. Tackle boxes there, this. Man, look at that shit. Bunch of, bunch of stuff right there. I think I have my, I don't know, I think I have my, my daughter's, my daughter's tackle box. That's the old retired bass thing right here. Check this out. Bam. Bam. Oh, whitey then. Man, look at that. That thing is full. So, whether it's bass fishing, crappie fishing, jug fishing, I've got it covered. Look, I even got a box down here. I mean, this is my, this is my tackle box I use to use, but I'm retiring this because it's got so much gear up in it now. It's crazy, it's crazy, it's crazy. Got my other tackle box, some stuff here. We got some old antique lures up in here. I think this antique one right here. This is one of the antique ones. Look, got some old antiquers in there, some boxes some stuff you know that's another goatee but goatees loaded with tackle 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 i mean dude i'm not playing i seriously have what it takes now my question to y'all is are you guys going to pick the right competitors to go up against me because once i get on that scene they can say oh my god oh my god that's bad boy dan i'm not going up against him and then they're going to walk off the show and give up so basically you wasted their time your time and their time just bringing them to the show to go up against a real competitor like me. And the reason why is because that TV show that y'all's casting for is the reality TV show. Me, being Fat Boy Dan, I am reality. Like I said, man, we got everything. My Ming Yang, walla walla bing bang. There's my Aqua Views back there you can see right here. We got the Aqua View underwater cameras. Situation gets it controlled. Man, look at this stuff, man. We got, man, we got all kinds. I got doves, I got sinkers down here. Man, look at this stuff. Rods. Look, rods. 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 Bam, look at that. Jug fishing. Like I said, man. Oh, man, I'm tripping over rods, tripping over rods. And we got more stuff over here. So here's some of my mainly users I like to use. Got my big catfish rods. You can see big cats back there. And we got boxes down here. Man, we got aerator. You know, keep them fish minnows alive, man. We got hooks down here, extra spools. I mean, stuff. We got dip bait, more dip bait, more dip bait. Dynamite! Dynamite! But, man, I'll tell you what, man. I've got what it takes to be on the Top Hooker reality TV show. And the reason why is because I'm Fat Boy Dan on YouTube. And if you're sitting there looking at me on YouTube, you clearly going to show. This boy got what it takes to jug fish, noodle. Y'all see the, the, the commercial nets back there, the cast nets. I mean, the jug stuff down here. Oh, I forgot to show y'all some of that. Damn, stepping over rods. I heard one snap. Nope, didn't snap. It's still good. Look, man, we got some boom. Some of y'all fans, y'all know who that is. Sunshine and Hunter. You know them are retired. Got my jug back down here. Showed people how to do that. There's jug and light, man. We got a bunch of them, some bobbers. Like I said, trout line stuff right here that we'll be setting up trout lines. Like I said, man, I got what it takes to be on top hooker. Like I said, do y'all got what it takes to be 
the other contestants could be up against me. I don't know, man. If I don't get picked for top hooker, then I'll tell you what, man. Y'all probably ain't really looking for a top hooker. Y'all probably just looking for someone to go out there and, and be average with everybody else out there. Because as soon as you pick me on that contest, I'm going to excel over everybody out there. And it's going to be like a no-win game. It's going to be like, dude, why are we bring this on there? It's going to be like bringing me onto the show and me being a pro up against all these amateurs. Now, I'm not considering myself to be the best. Not saying I'm the best, but until they find something better, I am here. Have no fear. Until then, write me a comment. Until then, I'll fish it out. I'll fish it out. Now, y'all come back now. You yeah?